Planet 9 or Planet X, new evidence of a mystery object on the periphery of our solar system. As astronomer at Caltech says, that new evidence has been discovered that indicates that there is a massive planet lurking somewhere on the outer edges of our solar system. It has been dubbed Planet 9 or Planet X Nibiru, what we would call, but that is only because Pluto is not considered to be planet anymore. If we included Pluto, this astronomical body would, of course, be called Planet 10 or Planet X. But scientists try very hard to avoid using that phrase, Planet X, because it's associated with so many quote-unquote conspiracy theories. Alex, uh, Zechariah Sitchin and the uh, ancient Sumerian uh, mythologies and texts talk about Nibiru. And we recently found that and the ancient Sumerios, uh, Sumerians called Jupiter Nibiru. Anyway, based on these new evidences that have emerged, it's believed that Planet 9 is approximately 20 times further away from our Sun than Neptune is, and it's being projected that it would take somewhere between 10,000 and 20,000 years for this planet to make one trip around the Sun. Perhaps due in part to legal training of this author, it says here, he says he's always been skeptical when it comes to things like this, and whenever anyone has tried, he says, to tell me about Planet X in the past, I've always wanted to see proof. And of course, solid proof regarding Planet X has always seemed to be in short supply. But there was a big change in that regard during uh, recently, following coming from the Independent, saying, objects have been spotted moving around unusually at the edge of our solar system. And the best explanation for the strange orbits is the mysterious Planet 9, or what we call Nibiru Planet X, according to one of the scientists who has urged, argued that the hidden planet does exist. A Jan in January, Paris scientists argued that they had found another planet based on calculations using objects at the distant end of our solar system. And by studying the orbit of six objects in the Kuiper Belt, a mysterious area thought to be filled with asteroids and other icy objects, they argued that they were being affected by something large and previously unknown, end quote. Finally support my Patreon accounts. The daily posts are five videos daily, and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box. So at that time, scientists were telling us that this newly discovered object was likely 10 times more massive than our Earth. So we are definitely not talking about some small piece of rock, 10 times the size of our planet. And now astronomer Mike Brown of Caltech has come forward with new evidence that this massive planetary body exists. And this comes from the Daily Mail. Quote, Mike Brown tweeted a photo that shows a plot of a newly discovered eccentric Kuiper Belt object, KBO. In the post, Brown wrote, Hey, Planet Nine fans, a new eccentric KBO was discovered, and it's exactly where Planet Nine says it should be. End quote. The KBO in question is UO3L91, shown with a solid blue line in the graph, and Brown writes that the slide comes from a recent talk at the SETI Institute. The discovery was made from an Outer Solar System Origin Survey, OSSOS, OSOS, at the Canada-France-Hawaii Telescope, according to a subsequent tweet. Of course, it is still too early to say anything really definitive about this new object. There are still plenty of skeptics, and back at NASA, they refuse to confirm or deny that this new planet even exists. Quote, in a YouTube video, Jim Green, Director of Planetary Science at NASA, addressed the new findings. The January 20 paper in the Astronomical Journal is, fueled, is fueling our interest in planetary exploration, Green said. Stimulating a healthy debate as part of the scientific process. It's not, however, the detection of a new planet. It's too early to say with certainty that there is a so-called Planet X out there. He pledged NASA experts would take part in the process to try and find it. Personally, I would not, the author says here, be surprised if it all turns out that there are numerous large objects out there that the public does not know anything about right now. For years, there's been rampant speculation that an astronomical body known as Planet X 
would soon approach the Earth and cause unprecedented natural disasters, and many of these predictions that have included specific dates have turned out to be false alarms. But that does not mean that something like this would not eventually happen someday. And this is the following excerpt from the Inquisitor article summarizing that some people believe about Planet X. Quote, According to conspiracy theorists, recently leaked secret NASA Planet X files reveal that the agency is aware that the gravitational influence of Planet X had disrupted the orbits of other planets during a previous passage into the inner solar system hundreds of years ago, and that the next disruptive passage into the inner solar system is imminent. The approach of the mysterious Planet X is currently sending waves of charge, quote, plasmatic energy particles, end quote, through our solar system, the flow of energy will finally disrupt the, quote, core flows, end quote, of the Earth and trigger catastrophic changes in Earth's climate. We have been feeling the disruptive effects of the inbound rogue planet X since 1996 in the form of increased seismic and volcanic activities, freak weather patterns, and natural disasters, end quote. And the author says, I don't know if any of this is true or untrue. But what I do know is that the Bible tells us that there will be, quote, signs in the earth and in the moon and in the stars, end quote, just prior to the return of Jesus Christ. This is something that I discuss in my new book, The Rapture Verdict, which is currently the number one new release in Christian eschatology on Amazon.com. Will some giant astronomical body play a role in causing those signs? I don't know. However, the author says, without a doubt, I will continue watching for new evidence of unusual things happening in our solar system. And it is true that heavenly bodies can have a tremendous influence on our planet. Over the past few years, I have detailed how earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, and other natural disasters have been increasing in number and intensity. How much of this activity can be attributed to forces outside of our own planet is certainly up for debate. Just like you, I'm still learning. And so far, I have not seen any solid evidence that an encounter with a giant celestial body known as quote-unquote Planet X is imminent, but it is entirely possible that I could come across something tomorrow that could completely change my mind. So what do you think about all of this talk regarding Planet X? This is on uh, Bended Reality. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support.